Today we will see the two method of crude operation in Power App using SharePoint list. Method 1 in SharePoint list we can integrate with the Power App. This method will take less than a minute to complete the task. It is very simple and easy method. So we can start now. I have already created a list called list 1. You can integrate, select power app, create power app, just name, give the name, click on create, it is done. So now we can check edit option. Click on save. When you refresh, you can see the data is modified here. So we can do the edit. Now we will see the delete option. If you delete here, data is deleted. And if you refresh, you can see here. Now we will add the new data. A, B, C, 1, 2, 3, 4. Click on save. You can see the data here. And also in the list, if you refresh, you can see the new entry. So we will see the second method. Second method called, we will do the crude operation from the scratch by using the canvas blank app. It will take 7 to 8 minutes only. So follow these steps. Insert a screen called list and we can Connect the data source with the SharePoint list. You can select this list, so it's showing the data source. You can select the SharePoint site. And it will show the lists. You can select the list too. So it is now connected to the list and the data is showing. We have only two records. If you open the list too. So it's connected here. The data is now we can do the all you can see the crude operations like add, edit, update, and delete. So we need to add this edit form. So if we select this list, the data will all, all the fields will display here. You can adjust this alignment. If you want vertical or horizontal. Now we can add the button controls.
we can see that save, edit, delete, all are working. So once it is done, we can share this uh, So once the functionality is done, you can work on the look and feel of the design, color, font, and the size of the layout, buttons, all those things. Thank you. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comment section.